What is going on, buddy? Dan Unfiltered, checking out Dance Gavin Dance. Elder Goose. Is that like an old goose? Like a grandma goose? Whatever. I, I think I, I always do it. Think too deeply in their fucking titles. Weird stuff. This comes from Ivan. A Patreon. If you guys have any requests, hit me up. And recently, I've heard Purple Rain off this album and Tidal Waves Breakfast, Lunch, and Dinner. And so far, again, only a couple songs I've heard from this one. So far, this might be the, or my personal favorite version of Johnny Craig's vocals. I really like the way he's kind of unleashed. On some of the other albums that he's done, I've said I w he sounds better when they kind of just let him go instead of just singing the the lyrics straight and just let him just let him fucking sing like they let Tilly and just just sing. Let Johnny Craig do it. So far on this album, it seems like they did. It's really good. Let's check it out. Elder Gro Goose. Elder Goose. Weird. Fucking weird. Fuck it, go. This is definitely, this is the best he said. This period in time, whenever year this was, this is Johnny Craig at his apex. That I've heard so far. I think he has like a different band nowadays, but from what I've heard so far from the man, this is, this is his, his peak. Fantastic. Bring it home. Uh, 
I wanted to stand up and do a full-fledged Tiger Woods fucking fist pump at the end of that. I don't want to hear shit. This is clearly Johnny Craig's apex. Clearly. This album is the one for him. This was his fucking album. Because John did his absolute best to fucking steal the song. To steal the show. It's a lot of times he does. It's just his style. He comes out of nowhere and just starts haymakering, like punching everyone in the room. And it's awesome. He tried that here. But Johnny Craig still kind of owned this song. Beginning to end. Especially the end. Like, John was, was, he was throwing 100 miles per hour. It didn't matter. Johnny Craig kind of matched the energy there. So, uh, someone better send me a fucking Dance Gavin Dance Tillian song very soon. Very soon. Tillian needs to respond. There need uh, He needs to fight back. Because right now, Johnny Craig, from this album, is stealing the Tillian momentum from my heart. Absolutely stealing it. Is this another rare Dance Gavin Dance song that I, that Tillian would not be better on? He would not have outdone Johnny Craig for this song. Not for this song. And Johnny Craig really flashing the raspy in this one. Like, a lot of, a lot of the other times I've heard him Kind of sounds like, kind of like a version of The Weeknd. Again, not exact, but a light version of The Weeknd. Here, there was a lot of rasp. A lot of rasp. Especially at the end there. When John was going completely in, he matched, he matched his fucking energy. And even played with a note at the end just as it's fading. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Yeah, Tillian. Look at me, Tillian. We got to fight back, homie. I'm on your side. I'm Team Tillian, but good lord, it's getting it's getting closer than than I thought it would. Jesus Christ! Hit like, Ivan. Appreciate you, homie. Damn good song, man. Damn good song. Elder Goose. That wouldn't be a bad band. It'd be a weird one, but it wouldn't be a terrible band name. It's one of those phrases that are so outlandishly strange that it kind of works. Elder Goose. I could easily see, like, Elder Goose at the bottom of a flyer for a concert. And opening act is Elder Goose. <laughs> I'd be here for it. If you are still here, then you are a real one. Johnny fucking Craig actually is making this a debatable. I thought Tillian had it won a long time ago. He's making it a debate. 